what would a 50 inch vertical look like on other planets? We are dealing with proportions. Here's a proportion of our vertical jump to Earth's gravity. If we manipulate this, then we have a formula that we can use for each planet. Now that we have our formula, let's start talking about the other planets. First, the moon. The moon's gravity is about one sixth of the Earth's, meaning your 50 inch vertical jump becomes over 300 inches. That's 25 feet in the air, high enough to clear a giraffe. Moving on to Mars and Mercury, their gravity is about 3.7 meters squared. That means you jump about 130 inches over 10 feet. That's enough to clear an NBA hoop like it's a hurdle. The next couple of planets, there are some complications. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune are all gas giants with no solid surface to jump off of. But let's say somehow you could. You jump 20, 47, 56, and 44 inches respectively. One thing that we forgot was the air resistance. All the gas giants have crippling air resistance as well as Venus, so you wouldn't be able to jump either. For example, Venus's air resistance is 92 times stronger than Earth's, but if we ignored air resistance, it'd be around 55 inches. But which planet can you jump the highest on? That'd be Pluto, with a gravitational pull of only 0.62 meters per second squared. You'd be able to jump a staggering 791.1 inches in the air. That's more than half the height of the Leaning Tower of Pisa. But let me ask you this. 